This Pulmiot 762 class setup has quickly become one of the best long range weapons in Warzone 3, so I'm gonna go through and break down every single attachment you need to be running to give your Pulmiot 762 zero recoil. So for the first and most important attachment on this build, we want to go ahead and throw on the Jack Annihilator Bullpup Conversion Kit, which as you can see in the detailed stats gives us an insane amount of buffs, but most importantly a 1354% increase to the minimum damage range, giving this build almost zero damage drop off, also a 41% decrease to the horizontal recoil, which is going to turn this gun into an absolute laser beam. Next up, we do want to go ahead and throw on the Spirit Fire Suppressor, which is going to get rid of our red dot on the minimap when we're firing our weapon. And on top of that, we are going to receive a buff to our recoil control, both velocity and the damage range. Easily the best suppressor in Warzone 3. Now for the third attachment, we want to throw on the best long range optic in Warzone 3, and that is going to be the Corio Eagle's Eye 2.5 times. This is the one and only optic that you should be using on your long range weapon builds, because it is one of the only magnification scopes in the game that gives zero added visual recoil, making it insanely good for long range gunfights. Before I do finish off the rest of the build, if you guys do enjoy my loadout videos, don't forget to smash that like and sub button. We post the best Warzone 3 loadouts every single day. And right now, over 96% of you guys who watch my videos are yet to subscribe, so do your boy a favor and hit that big red subscribe button down below. Back into the build, for the fourth attachment, I am going to give you guys two separate options, with the first one being the D15 recoil reduction stock. This is going to do exactly what it sounds like, gives us a 21.3% decrease to the recoil gun kick, 6.4% to the horizontal recoil, and a near 12% decrease to the vertical recoil. I see a ton of people running this on their build, but me personally, since I am mainly a rebirth player, I do like to throw on the Nod Z3 grip, which as you can see does almost the exact same thing. 10% to the recoil gun kick, 7.3% to the horizontal recoil, and 8.2% to the vertical recoil. But what we do get on this grip that we don't get on the stock is a 4.1% decrease to the aim down sight speed, which is very nice to have on these smaller maps like Ashika Island or Vondel Park, but honestly they are super similar and I can hardly tell a difference between the two. And for the final attachment to complete this build, once again, you are going to have two separate options. The first one is going to be better for you if you're playing the big map, and it is going to be the Jack Annihilator Long Barrel, which as you can see when we open up the more detailed stats, we get 34% of the effective and minimum damage range, as well as a 18% buff to our bullet velocity, which is going to of course make this thing do much more damage at the long distances. And then once again, since I am a rebirth player and I'm really not going to get into too many long distance gunfights, what I like to do is throw on the Bruin Heavy Support Grip, just once again, giving us a huge increase to the overall recoil control, making this gun have no joke zero recoil, one of the easiest guns to use in the entire game. Here's the full Meta Pulmiot 762 build for Warzone 3 Season 1, easily one of the best long range weapons in the game right now, and with it I drop a crazy 30 plus kill game on Vondel Park, so with that being said, let's get into it. No way, Pablo Escobar's in my game. Kill confirmed. We located the rest no. Oh, my slam. No. Oh, blow. Oh, my God. Four forty five OP. Oh, I get that kill. <laughs> My bad, bro. Marked remaining operators from that squad. Dude, this ground loot striker is like easily the best ground loot in the game. Oh! He got my fold though, I like that guy. He tried to hit me with the camera, bro. Okay. Target down. Marking the rest of them. This shotgun so ridiculous. Marking the rest of that squad on your attack map. How's that a hit marker? Attack map to hunt down the rest of them. Enemy soldier incoming.
I'm just getting pushed by kids on these staircase and they're just they're just dropping like flies. I see. Damn. Okay. This kid just jumped scared the f out of me. Oh my god, I hate life. You got gas moving in. Percocet. Molly Percocet. It's gone. <laughs> yeah. Morgan Wallen. Gas is closing yeah. in. Game, brother. Dude, yeah, don't ever shoot me in the back again. Slap you around like a dumb little rag doll. Enemies are dropping into the area. I'm getting shouldered right now. Like a dumb little what? Toss you around like a dumb little rag doll. Yeah, it's flat lobby. Hurry off! Can... You're so rare, right, James. Yeah. Move it. Couldn't be more spot on. I don't know if you're kind of Like, okay. You yeah. Get out of my lobby, buddy! Ten remain. You're almost Hell done yeah. here. I got the two sweats off. They're out. He just tried to heal me off ahead glitch, but he got hyped. Buddy, you are nothing. And he's anymore. dead, James. He's dead. That's 30 piece. Now you're getting crazy talking. Put a child. There's Pablo from early game. It ruined my game. This could have been a 40, but Pablo ruined it. I don't like this spot, man. I'm scared. Oh, oh. I'm scared. Oh. I see you on the beach, buddy. I see you on the beach. Let's go. Full 34 piece, first game on.